An ox cart ought to make our journey easier. One hopes these carts offer comfort commensurate to their costs. What did he say his name was again? The lad's in Vermouth now. Expedition, sword drip. Say, you look experienced. You should talk to the... I overheard some of the soldiers standing guard outside the palace discussing a curious rumor. Oh, I've no time for you now. I can do for you. It is my duty to hear the people. Off we trot. to tie my boots. Dreams are free, I say. How is a welcome sight? Not a care in the world. Just as it should be. I suppose I ought not shut rehearsal. I might head to my must remember to dust the show. Greetings. You seek guidance, do you not? You have lost sight of your path, but I can point the way. You need only make a worthy offering in exchange. If the way forward is shrouded to you, if the way forward is shrouded to you, it is lovely to see you. We're not to talk during mission. I've no time. Now I have to go to the market. What's the market up to? Come on. Play 
Sir, how can I be of assistance? Is here that the bodies of those who fall in vermin are first kept and tended to. I beg you to conduct yourself with care and with a reverence befitting of one who walks among the dead. I have placed a mark upon. Perhaps this will seem of little consequence, but the pain I experienced at the coronation was beyond imagining. There will be a reckoning for this. I shall not suffer others to mimic our master's powers. Is, I beg you to conduct yourself with care and with a reverence befitting of one who walks among the dead. Your patronage is... What's your problem? Thanks. I enjoy. 
enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's thrills to gathering items. I am confident and may act independently. I found a place with some useful materials for in. Ox carts make for relatively safer travel. They can be most convenient, though they only travel during the day. We're setting out. Jump on if you've paid. I must earn. All this waiting around puts me to sleep. Your the personage of great esteem is to return from Batal to Vermin. I speak of Sir Augustine. He is a noble and the leading voice of opposition against the Queen Regent. Your aid is requested in guarding his ox cart as it travels the high road. As a potential ally to your cause, it would do you no favors if he were to come to harm. I trust he will cooperate. And bear in mind that this is a matter of the utmost secrecy. Not even the captain of the guard has been informed of it. You have your orders. Read them and follow them to the letter. Our aid is required, master. Let us depart with due haste. There are one or two places of interest nearby. I could tell you more about them if you like, Master. Whoa! Hey! I see! 
attacks would only be to his advantage. We'll have to try something else. The fire must be put out ere our comrade burns. My curative magics are at your disposal. Wait a moment. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. This ox cart's bound. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Magnificent tapestry of stars. How is this so? I knew you would prevail, Master. I dare say, the arisen feet of this knowledge are out of us. Resounding success.
About time you showed up. We've been waiting for you. Our mission is simple. Sir Augustine will board the Oxcart. We must safeguard it from would-be assailants till it reaches its destination. See to it that none approach. The Queen Regent supporters will come for Sir Augustine's head. Of this, we can be certain. Oh, a quiet day is a welcome one. Come along now. What was that sound? Who's there? Hold a moment. I'll be handling Augustine's escort from here. Foul brigand! We shan't allow Sir Augustine to fall prey to the likes of you! There's no need for theatrics. I know your aim here. Ah, here's a surprise. We met at the tavern, remember? Fair warning, cuz. This craven isn't worthy of your trust. He speaks madness! Subdue him at once, ere he injures our noble charge! Why? It isn't so right, not from the tavern! You would betray me. <laughs> Have you lost all sense? You believe me, then? That's a bit of a relief, actually. Thanks, cuz. Curse you! All that planning and... For what? Phew! I appreciate the confidence, cuz. It was a welcome surprise. But I can't linger here, I'm afraid. My apologies for this. Follow after me if you can. Succeed, and I'll share the truth of all of this. Whatever choice you make, Arisen, I'm sure it will be the right one. Pleasant and cool. Chopper's master! This one will recoil from today! The fire must be put out ere our comrade burns! Ending, if I do say so myself. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? A cave. Shall we proceed into the depths? What I wouldn't give for a map, particularly one that could tell us where all the treasure lies. Very well, if I must. Master! Master, can you hear me? Are you unharmed? Pray, seek an exit. I shall... We meet again. Oh, 
Ahoy there. I take it you lost your footing as well? You seem to have fared better than I did. I took the fall for Augustine, only to find myself waist-deep in monsters. Still, so long as he escaped, I'd wager that makes this a job well done. Speaking of, I was to tell you the truth behind all of this, wasn't I? I'll be glad to oblige you, of course, but we ought to get moving first. What say I explain while we search for an exit? Time to get to work. From what I've seen of your skills during that mess in the tavern and today's business, I can say you're really something. And my word ought to carry a fair bit of weight, considering my reputation as a warrior of unparalleled skill. Though of late, I've mostly been playing escort to spineless nobles. Turns out, as a sellsword proves himself, the list of those who can afford his services grows shorter and comes to be written in finer ink makes for a duller life, though I can't say I've any complaints about the weight of my pockets. <laughs> Still, I hunger for a real battlefield, where a single misstep spells death. I crave the simplicity of it, there's naught else like it. The clashing of bodies and wills. I'd not say no to a fight with you. Let's have at it when I'm all healed up, eh? <laughs> Mayhap, I'll not give you a choice in the matter. I'm not sure what's brought me here. I suppose I'll have a few drinks and hit the hay. That escort mission was a trap concocted entirely for your benefit, you know. It was supposed to give those responsible a means to incriminate you. But Augustine is no fool. He had his doubts about his summons to Vermin and hired me to watch over him in an unofficial capacity. So I looked into the cart that would be escorting him, and lo and behold, I found your name. But twasn't on the list of hired guards, oh no. Rather, your name was on the list of persons to be on guard for. In short, you had been called in to act the part of the culprit. Mark my words, if you'd carried on with them, Augustine would have been slain, and you would have been held responsible. You'd not have stood a chance against all that if it hadn't been for me. Aye, methinks I've earned my pay this time, and then some. I protected my charge and got you away from the scene without your being branded a murderer and thrown in jail. Now all that remains is to escape this place. I expect we'll find a way out soon enough, if we only press on. Still. I've got to wonder where this craven plot came from, and what you did to warrant it. One thing's for certain, you must have powerful enemies in Vermin. But why? Tis not as though you're the Arisen True. What? You are the Arisen. Ha! <laughs> 
is a small world indeed. You've piqued my interest even further, cuz. I've no business here. Best I hit the road. <laughs> Right, let's press on. Judging from the flow of air here, the exit can't be far. Quite awful place to be cut short. At least you made it out all right. Don't worry, cuz. I'll be fine on my own. After all, I can't afford to die here. We haven't had ourselves a real bout yet. We'll see each other again. You can count on that. And when we do, you'd best be ready for the fight of your life. We are reunited at last, Master. I do hope you encountered no trouble in the cave. All done, then? Pray. Follow me. I know the way, so there's no chance of our getting lost. <laughs> <laughs> 